the show. We're going to lay under the safari in 85 Fahrenheit weather and maybe change an engine mount or two, boys. Got the new engine mounts right here, I do. And the, uh, the old ones are just cocked right over. But I'm going to sit down, have a coffee, have a vapage, and uh, hopefully get to her, for freak's sakes. Oh, boys and girls, I got one mount out. I want to do one mount off camera to see how it goes, hey? So I don't look like a total goofball. But uh, I'd have to say that mount is cocked, big time, hey? But uh, at least these mounts look like they're the right ones. So we're having a freaking bonus. That bolt was a bitch because all the rubber's all dicked over and popped out and whatnot. It didn't, wow, boys. It wasn't too bad, just a lot of inchworming, eh? If you know what I mean, the old wrench. There she is, boys, she's out. Thank God this van has been oiled every year. Look at her, boys. 92, just so you know. Look at the shape of her. She's freaking decent under here. Freaking right. Well, video record putting that one in. Hopefully I can get the angle of the freaking dangle for you. Frig, I don't know if I'll be able to get the angle of the dangle for you down here, boys, but I was gonna do this at work on the hoist, but uh, don't have a tranny jack, so how the hell am I gonna lift the motor? At least here, I got my block of wood on the oil panage, little jack a couple jack stands, Bob's your freaking uncle. Bob's your freaking freaking uncle, boys. We'll get the new mount in here and see how she goes. We will. And I'm going to be covered in just everything by the time I've done this freaking job. And i got to look for the old tripodage for this camera. So I can tripodage you. Figure it right out. So first thing we need to do before we go put this back in is take all these bolts and we'll clean them off with the old wire wheelage there to uh, make it easier to thread on. Why wouldn't we? There we go. These are actually in pretty damn good shape, they are. Now remember, when you do an engine mount in a vehicle, always do one side first and then the other side. Don't unbolt both sides because then the motor will just get all cocked over and turned around and upside down and whatnot and, and you won't be able to line it up. I don't even know if I can line it up yet because the other uh, engine mount is as bad a shape as that one I just showed you. We'll have to freaking see, we will. So let's grab a mount and I'll grab a trailer hitch to hold you because I can't find my trusty ding dong. This might be under there. Then we'll slide ourselves under here with the old Mount Ruski. Can you see? Probably friggin' not. Good luck seeing, just saying. Hopefully I can catch an angle of the dangle for you. Right up there is where we're going. Can you see that? I hope so. Because uh, if you can't, that's just too damn bad because I gotta get her done, boys. No fucking around here, Jim. So we'll slide her up in like this. And then we'll put a bolt in the hole and we'll get her lined up. There we go. There's one in, there's two in, and there's three in, boys. So, before we tighten these up, I'm gonna fuck the final, Bubba. Hey, fuck the I know. Oh God, they thread nice. Make sure you clean your threads, boys, because they do slide on there nice when the threads are nice and clean, they do. You can turn her with a finger, boys. There we go. And of course, the other nut is underneath my jack hole. Did I get it? Probably not. How in the F did I get that in there? Boys, we can't move the jack. Pulling the engine up. There it is. We got her, we did. And of course I say the worst one for last. Oh man, how am I gonna get up in there, Jim? Oh, my fingers aren't small enough. Oh, twist, twist, twist. Oh, I dropped it. Son of a beaver. Oh, here it is. So the only other way I can figure out doing this one Put her in the open end wrench a ruski like so. Get her up where she needs to be, Jim. And then turn this side. Can't see Dick. I'm going all by field, boys. I might have got her, Jim. Sure did. Decent. So there we go. So now that that's done, we can snug them up a little bit. Snuggle a little bit oh. Hey. Reverse on the doodad. And we need to get this in here, and we need to get that on there, and we need to start giving her, boys. Snuggy, snuggy. Snuggy as a ruggy, boys. No. Come on, baby. Catch. Why do things have to be so awkward? Oh, hey. Oh, yeah, it's a safari. <laughs> Time done this, boys. My arms are going to fall off. Eh, 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 eh,
Oh, fuck. God damn, boys. Hopefully my fan's not cocking you over. It probably is, but I don't care. It's freaking hotter than dicks out today. And I'm giving myself a blowjob later or, or not, boys. Gotta do what you gotta do, you do. That fan is actually keeping me from sweating. I'll tell you that right freaking now. All right, so there's one. One. We'll save the ignorant one for last. I wonder if I should even tighten this down right now. I should probably... Yeah, let's do that. Holy, that's going to be hard to figure out. I need a second person for this. How you doing? So. Uh, 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 I can't even see, boys. Frig. Hey, let's line up this engine mount. Why? Why the hell wouldn't we? Okay. Uh, uh, she's off by a quarter mile. Because the other engine mount's cocked. Careful. Easy. Gentle. Oh, she's going. Oh, yeah, we did. Ooh, eh? Now we gotta get the right size and see if we can't zing her in, Jim. Frickin' right! And that there is how the dirty old Delson puts an engine mount in, boys. Almost like I knew what I was doing, eh? I know, I still gotta tighten them out. I just wanted to get this bolt in. Look at that, boys. Friggin' started, everything is going smooth. Only because the old man oiled the shit out of this thing from day one. She is friggin' decent. Sure, it's a messy job, but it's still decent. So we get this back through here, like so. If it will go on this way. No, friggin' dick. Friggin' dick, boys. Kinda cock ourselves into position. You know what I wish I brought home from work is my friggin' air ratchet. There ain't a hole in the frame there, is there? Boys, that wouldn't be that easy. Am I got the right size here? What's going on? No, I don't. We're running a 15, boys. I need a 15, I do. Decent. That deserves a... Yeah, we did. Why wouldn't I? Okay, oh, back at her. Captain. Oh, my hands fall asleep, boys. The old carpal tunnel's kicking in. Woo. Make sure you tighten the bejesus out of these things. There's the torque specs on them, but uh, my torque specs is tighter dick. That's the way I always work. How tight do you put that? Tighter dick. Hey, okay. tighter dick, boys. Oh my god. My hands are sleeping, boys. Oh, I already tightened that one, didn't I? Freaking right, I did. All right, so there, now all we got to do is zing, ding, 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 that guy. Which I can do, hopefully, from where I'm laying so I don't have to get up because I'm kind of comfy, I am. Is that the right one? Nope. Oh, I guarantee I'm gonna have to get up just because this one wants to cock me right over. Nope. 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 All right, so now we'll do the reach around and we'll give her a zoop zoop zoom, eh? Zoop zoop. Caramel! There we go. One engine El Mounto a dunno, boys. Decent. Okay, boys and girls, I've decided that I'm never going to do a passenger side engine mount in a freaking safari ever again. Frick, no, I'm not. I've got it in. But it's been a real bitch. The bolts for it are up inside the frame in here. Okay? So there's two and there's a third one way up there that you gotta use a weeble wobble on. Oh boys, and now I, I lost the third nut. So just cocked over, okay? But I'm gonna win. I always win, boys, but I'm just saying. Pastor side, no funny. Frig no. So now you have to figure out what size that is because the nut is gone. I've been blowing on the frame for 20 minutes. I give it a little why wouldn't I? And I still can't find it. Can't wipe my nose. Got a fly on my friggin' leg that's driving me fucking crazy. It won't leave me alone. And this is not the other thing. So, I'm gonna get up, find a bolt, hopefully get it back up there. Can you see? Way up inside the frame there. Yeah, I gotta go through this little hole up in there, and the bolt's way up there, boys. And I lost a nut in here somewhere, and I've tried magnet blowing and everything else, so. She's gone, she is. Friggin' right it is. Let's get our asses up here and maybe clean up, have a little break, and see if we can't get a lock nut. Well, got the van all done, I did, eh? Got my van all done, got cleaned up, cleaned up the frickin' garage ruski, and she's done, boys. Like I showed you earlier, I think, there's one. Hey, there's one of them. Look at it. Decent. It's frickin' decent, boy. And the other one wasn't as bad, but it was still, it was the worst one to change, eh? Hey? Plaster side. Oh, Joe's a pain in the ass to change it, but look at her, she's cracked. So, one more thing done for the old dirty old Bills. So freaking right, boys. If 
but got a picnic to go to today and this and that and the other thing so it should be pretty fun eh freaking right it should don't forget to subscribe and like and hit that notification bell bar button if you like changing the engine mounts and the old safari but anyways hopefully everybody's having a good sunday like i am and don't do anything i wouldn't do and uh you know what to do for now